We want to pray with you, and we ask you to uh, allow your hearts and minds to be upon the Lord uh, Jesus Christ. We thank you, Father, and we praise you. You told us in your word that if my people that are called by my name would humble themselves and pray, uh, seek your face and turn from their wicked ways. You say, Father, that you would hear from heaven. You forgive our sins and heal our land. We need you, Father, to heal our land. We thank you for the prayers of the righteous uh, availing much. We thank you for your ear being in tune to the cry of the righteous. And we cry out today as children of God, and we ask you, God, to intervene, to intercede. Give us victory over this virus. We pray, God, that you would let them find a speedy answer, a speedy solution, that they'll get the vaccine and things that they need, that our nation, this world could be healed. We pray, we pray especially for the first responders. We pray for the nurses and doctors and those that are on the front line who are risking their lives, God, for the lives of others. We are truly in a war fighting an unseen force. We thank you for the firemen all of those emergency workers, God. We thank you for the grocery store. People putting their life on the line to make sure we have the necessities of life. We thank you, God, for all the essential workers. And thank you for the truck drivers. Everybody that's involved, God, in getting us through this season, we pray you bless them, uh, that you keep them, God, and let them see your hand in ways they've never seen it uh, before. We pray for the Philippian Community Church family. We pray you breathe on us. We thank you for keeping us. We thank you for allowing your blood to cover us. And we trust you, God, for the victory through our Lord uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, we trust you, God, for Philip Iconania. We ask you to bless all the pastors, all the ministers. And once again, God, for keeping this virus away from us. And for those of us that have been affected by the virus, we just trust you uh, for healing trust you for the victory. We pray, God, for every family that has been affected. And we hear about so many deaths and so many having died. We pray, God, that's another family that's weeping. And some families are not even able to see their loved ones, can't visit them. And then when they die, they can't even go see them. We pray, God, you give them comfort and comfort them uh, as only you can do. We pray, God, for the mayor. We pray for the president, we have every congressman. Uh, we pray for those that are in authority. You told us, God, if we but pray for those that are in authority, we could lead a quiet and a peaceable life. God, we ask you to give them the solution. Give them what to do. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. You turn it with us whoever ye will, and these leaders come together, and we see the unity that you've created in this world not just in America, God. We pray you bless that unity. You say it in your word, when a people are one, who can constrain them? As we come together, God, let us see your hand uh, like we have never seen it uh, before, Father. And we trust you. We trust you, God, to keep us, uh, sustain us. Let us be encouraged. We pray for our children, that you bless our children, bless our parents home with our children. We pray for a greater family bond, that families will come closer together uh, during this season. We pray that their love would grow, uh, not just in our home, but also um, in our city, in our country, Father, uh, in the name of Jesus. And as we're praying, God, I'm mindful of Jehoshaphat uh, when he prayed before the Lord. And he said, God, we have no might against this great company. We don't have the solution, God. We don't have the might. And he said something. He said, our eyes are on you. Jehoshaphat knew that you were going to do something, Father. He knew that you had the solution. And now today, God, our eyes are on you. We know you have the solution. We know you're going to give us the victory in Jesus' name. 
and we'll be so careful to give your name praise, honor, and glory. Thank God. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Somebody in the balcony. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. He's been my friend. No, we don't sing like that no more. He's been my friend.